Hello viewers, welcome to another episode of Jammer and Form. In my last video, I have shown how to use entries or text boxes in our Jammer and Forms application. In this video, I am going to show you how to use buttons and how to handle button click event. Let's create a new page for discuss about buttons. Create a new item. Create a content page and name the page buttons. Change the startup page as button. To add a button into your page, you need to add a tag called button. Add a tag button. Give the text. Save. For on this application, you will find a button. Okay, that's good. Click. Create a click event of this button. If you click on this button, it will go into this function. Okay, let's create another lab label. Change the text of this level. Okay, let's run this application. Okay, that's good. We can change the properties of this button. Contains background color. Text. We can change font attribute. Bold. Okay, let's run. Okay, that's good. I'll give a margin of this layout. There is another way you can handle your button click event. For that, you need to set command in your button and you need to write that command into your C-sharp code behind page. I have created another button. And I will use a command here. Public I command. New command click on command button and use this function here. We have to set this command 
you have to bind this command and you have to set a binary context equal to this let's run this application okay if i click on this button show click on command button there is some advantages to use command in your button you can set common parameter in your button we'll use a common parameter as per help and use pass the string string Steer. use this okay let's run this application if you click on this button it's showing the text of this par parameter there is another advantage is of using command is that if you have multiple buttons using the same command you can pass different parameter to this command okay i have copy this code and use the same command and pass different parameter just i am changing the color of this background color green yellow okay if i click on this button it's showing as per help and click this button it's showing German forms in this way we can pass different parameter using command let's design a button vertical option center background color transparent border color for screen border width 1.5 corner radius 50 and change the background color of this space Background color. I will use hexadecimal value. If I click this button, I will display alert. change the text color white and font attribute just bold font size large text save okay if i click this button it's alert 
displaying alert by this way you can create your button as your own style that's all about buttons in my in my next video i am gonna how to use image in our jamarin form application thanks for watching my video